my Nicaraguan American friends. You've survived the turmoil of the revolution of the 70s. You survived the US occupation of the early 1900s. And today, you exist in America as great members of American society and, and South Florida as well. Uh, I love how, how uh, Nicaragua has dealt with renewables, uh, geothermal technology, uh, using, using uh, steam from, from the volcanoes to create energy is, is amazing. And it's something that, that the United States can work with Nicaragua uh, on to benefit both nations. I know that there are a number of, of health issues in Nicaragua, things like sanitation and clean water uh, poverty, but these are also things that we can help from the United States uh, to Nicaragua with uh, utilizing NGOs, nonprofits, um, churches, other organizations, business organizations uh, to help uh, Nicaragua prosper. Um, and so not just not just to to prosper here in America, but also to help uh, those of your families and friends at home as well. Um, I, I love the issue of the compradasco, uh, this bond between uh, parents and and their and their children. Family is very important uh, to me, and I know it is to you as well here in America. We want to see our families thrive. Um, I want you to know that I will always be um, easily accessible um, for you to, to speak with uh, about your concerns. Uh, I also need you as well to guide me in success, uh, not just here, but, uh, but all, all around the world to, to, uh, to, help, to help us here in South Florida and our nation and, and also to, to, uh, to help, as I said, your friends and family. Um, on, on a different part of the globe. Uh, please, please help me in these initiatives and please guide me. And I thank you so much for listening.